Hey everybody, happy Tuesday. And first thing, congratulations to everyone who made it through uh, Monday's workout, good job. Um, jumpsuit is gonna be kind of a two-parter, one time. First workout leads directly into the second part. This is a descending rep scheme into an ascending rep scheme. And usually that gets uh, a little tougher on that second half, so don't take it for granted. Uh, so here's what it is. 30, 20, 10, meaning you'll do 30 of both movements, 20 of both movements, 10 both movements, and so on throughout this workout. Deadlifts and box jumps. 30, 20, 10, directly into 10, 20, 30 of kettlebell swings and row for calories. Side note, the ladies' calories at the final movement on the rower is 7, 14, 21, not 10, 20, 30 like it is for the gentlemen. All right, so let's check out what our at-home folks are doing. Unless you happen to have all this equipment, you can do this version. But if you're not that lucky, then let's talk about your version. All right, so for our at-home variation, Merit Anywhere, you guys are going to have five rounds for time of 10 double dumbbell deadlifts, 20 lateral hops over the dumbbell, then 10 more double dumbbell push press, and then finally, finally, 20 lateral hops over the dumbbell again. So 10 for your weighted movements and two sets of those 20 lateral hops per round. Five rounds, four time. All right, so uh, two couplets and they're gonna go right directly into each other. So uh, for this, we wanna think about the fact that we have two workouts, each one's 120 reps total because of the two movements. So you're doing 240 total reps. Um, and each one of these has a component of using your posterior chain or the muscles here on the back side of your body, you know, that lower back to brace your glutes and your hamstrings. So try to uh, break these up a little more, maybe so that you don't fatigue that uh, as much right away or make it so it gets tougher as you get into those later rounds. So a way to maybe attack this one is those deadlifts and kettlebell swings. You break up a little bit more in those bigger sets, especially at the beginning and the end. And then on the rower and box jumps, try to just keep moving. Um, there's examples of rep schemes below. Uh, it's not crazy heavy weights today, but you might still wanna give that time under tension break because you are holding on to a deadlift or to that kettlebell for quite a while in your rounds of 30. It might be tempting, especially in the beginning, to go hot and try to knock out 30 reps, but that's probably gonna catch up to you, especially if you did Monday's workout and you uh, went a little quick in that first round and you saw how quick that thing fell off the cliff. All right, so that's it today, guys. Uh, have fun, hop in a class, message us once again if you have any questions, and we'll see you again tomorrow for another one. Bye.